Have you heard the latest scuttlebutt from the General Rabble? Rumors are flying that Commander Vandom's successor is going to be one of the two of us. I intend for it to be me. I'll work my way up and drag Blade kicking and screaming into the modern era. That's what I expect from my rival. It should be an exciting race to the top. Oh, I'm almost giddy. In the meantime, let's continue our record of one perfect mission after the next. I spoke to Eleonora. I take it you're the no-pawn who has been asking after me? Huh? Glass's friend is HB? Haha, <laughs> the scope of my fame is terrifying. My name has become a chorus across races. Friends of Lala always talk about amazing men with 200 IQ. And prones speak of combat skills. Say you fight anything, that no creature is too fierce. Yes, all true, I'm afraid. <laughs> My partner here will attest to it. Admirable. A lesser blade would be blinded with envy, and yet you remain a beacon of truth. Now, what was it you needed? I'll do anything within my power. Which is anything. That worked just like Eleonora said. Quiet, fool. Earth alien is falling for it. Do not be so honest. Hmm? What's this about honesty? Just another fine trait of friend HB. Lala and Tentacle Friend have a job only amazing men like HB can do. Recently, terrible prone people are hurting poor Nopon. It is Blood King Delvo Bon. Even among Cavern Clan, his brutality is known. The name says it all, I suspect. A few days ago, Bloody King attacked Caravan on trade route and roast everyone. If friends do not help, no pawn everywhere become lunch. Despicable. This barbarian must be brought to heal as soon as possible. But Bloody King is clever. No one knows where his super secret base is. Hiding in shadows, tormenting the weak. Typical cavern scum behavior. Lala heard Pathfinder friends good at gathering info, came to seek help finding Bloody King. Well, we are the eyes and ears of Blade. All of Mira is our backyard. I'll have a look on Frontier Nav straight away. Hmm. Right. I'd say we found our base. Amazing! My clansmen looked everywhere. Found nothing. What magic is this? Just the magic of hard work and diligent data probe installation. All the answers are just a click away. But for now, I have a despot to topple. Friends do that for Pulala? Pulala heard fighting was Harrier job. I don't trust anyone else to finish what I've started. I'll see it through. Well, I and my new assistant here. Isn't that right? I'm glad I asked you for help in this matter. Some blades cling to that obsolete system of segregated divisions. It does my heart good to see that you are not one of them. Bringing this Blood King to justice will be yet more proof that I am correct on this.
Nicely done. gone. We couldn't save even one of them. We should hurry to that caravan. I'll not permit another fragile life to be snuffed out by this monster. <laughs> Anger? Yes, I suppose I got emotional there. Not like me, I know. I blame it on your bad influence. I'm sorry. Forgive me. I'll be back to my usual self by the time we catch up to the Blood King. We'll complete the mission with our usual precision. Go! 
I knew the prone had superhuman strength, but that... If you hadn't been with me, I fear I would have... Well, died. You have my thanks. Now, let's hurry back and inform Pulala. Your noble people will never have to fear that monster again. Consider him deposed. Permanently. This true? Truly? Pulala, oh! <laughs> not have words! HB is amazing! HB is best friend in world! HB is genius! And seeing you so happy makes me happy as well. Such happiness is the reason we fight. It's a simple truth that is easily forgotten. Though I fear the current state of Blade is too inefficient to help everyone. Once I'm in charge, however, I'll whip the system into a logical order and have productivity through the roof. You're one of my scant few equals, you know, so I expect big contributions in the future. <laughs> 